We're on the air. <clears throat> We're up to the Mishnah on Kuf Yutes on the base. Kuf Yutes on the base. Let's say some film before we begin. Um, Nasan Maya Ben Pesha Rachel, Gittel Bas Yuta, Shangle Simon Bas Gettel, Sar Racham Bas Lamas Rava, Sar Toiba Bas Chai Liba, Ellen Chaya Bas Nina Chivit, Chayim Rilan Bas Mashit, Sivia Huba Devar Bas Chana Rivka, and Alana Hadasa, Tehila Hadasa Bas Alana, the Sosha Choy Israel. Shem Allah, Smokim Kursi Hadanoi. Hadanoi Shemov Kali, Tihiena, Snacha Kashuva, Isakal Tatanoi. Okay, so tonight we're up to Kuf, you, Kuf you test on the base. Uh, we're basically finishing off for the Masechta. We're finishing off the, the Seder. The Seder, and we're going to see a Chiddush, some Chidushim, as always. And Be'ez Hashem, this year we should have, give a Sikkim, Be'ez Hashem, and, and maybe tomorrow night, we'll go through a Rebbe Kivega to give us a little understanding of the Seder and a little uh, Hadracha. So we say, Eim Aftirin Achra Pesach Apikoinen. He's a very famous, probably, um, if you had a, if you had to tell you Mishnayis Valped, this would be the one to say, right? right. Now, what, what exactly does it mean? The Rashbam says, you take leave of your friend. When you leave your Suda, you shouldn't, don't, you don't finish it with Afi Koyman. Don't finish it with Afi Koyman. Now, what does Afi Koyman mean? We're going to see two Pshatim. We're going to see, no, that's not, yeah, sort, sort of one of the pshatim. We'll see another pshat. Says the Gemara Mairei, my afikoymen. Afikoymen is a, a Greek word, and it's a retreat, and it's made up of, of, of two separate words. My afikoymen, amarav, shloyo'oku mechabura lechabura. It means you should not go from one chabura to another chabura. And the lashon of afikoymen is ofik minayhu, to take out your minayhu, your kalim. In other words, do not go from one chabura to another chabura. If you, you're one Chabura, we don't let you go to another Chabura. You know why? If you eat in the other Chabura, it'll be, it'll be seen like you're eating the current Pesach in two separate Mekomos. We said that you can eat the, a single current Pesach could be eaten in two Chaburas. You can eat it, but you can't eat the current Pesach in two Mekomos. Like, you know, if it's so all right, go ahead, and I eat one place, and then I take my kale into another place. So therefore, it means over here, aim after you as a Pesach, you come in. Do not, after you come in, do not take your do not take leave and eat in another place. Why? Because it, it seems like you're eating the Korban Pesach in two Mekomas, which is not permitted. What about in the same place would you be able to eat? Yeah, yeah. If, in other words, Afikom means the Lashon Af, Afik Minayu, you're taking over, you're taking your, your, your leave, you're taking your Kalim and you're putting them in another area. So in that case, in that case, we say that you can't do it, but you would be able to eat in the same place according to Rav. That's the Afikom, that's Rav's Pshat. Shmuel Omer, Kigoyin Arduloi Li, when I eat my, my mushrooms, my truffles, because Lysala Abba, Abba was Abba Richter, was Rav, and his pigeons. In other words, this is like Aaron Lieber would say, dessert. And therefore, meaning, after Afi Komen, you can't, after Afi Komen, you can't eat anything. Afik means Afik Mine Targima. You're going to take different types of sweets. And that's the more than one that we kind of understand. So you have two Pshatan now. You can't leave Pesach by taking your kalim, going to another place. That's according to Rab. According to Shmuel, you can't eat something else. And the reason being is we want the tam of the carbon Pesach to be prolonged in our mouth. Again, we don't have a carbon Pesach anymore. All we have is matzah. And if you go ahead and you can eat something else, it's going to be the tam of the matzah. And therefore, therefore we, don't, we, don't, uh, we don't eat anything afterwards. So those nafkamina would be again. Can you eat anything? According to Rav, if you're in the same place, you could eat. According to Shmuel, if you're in the only, you can't eat even in the same place because why? Because you don't take out you know, the different types of of dessert. Rav Chanina Bar Shila of Rabbi Yechonon, they agree with Shmuel. Kigoyin, what, what shouldn't you eat? Kigoyin, tamarim, dates, kloyos, parched grain, vegoyzim, and nuts. Tanya Kavasi Rabbi Yechonon, aim after Pesach. You don't take leave of the Pesach. 
by by eating kigoyim tamarim klayus vegaisim. That apparently, so that's that's what it means. Any maftir, you don't take leave of by eating these various types of. Now, oh, this is but bizman the carbon pesach. What about this? Am Rav Yudam Shmuel, a maftir and acha matza afi kolmen. A maftir and acha matza afi kolmen. You don't go ahead and take leave of your matza afi kolmen. Tanan, a maftir and acha pesach afi kolmen. Says the Gemara, acha acha pesach who deloy. Only after the current Pesach can you not, because you want to prolong the case, taste of the current Pesach. Aval acha matzah, but if the matzah, enochinami maftirin. So l'chayra, you would be able to. It's a kasha on Rav Yehuda in the name of Shmuel. How can you tell me that you can't eat anything after the matzah? Only after the current Pesach you can't eat anything. But if the matzah, you could. Says the no, let me boy, come out. You don't need to tell me. Let me boy, acha matzah, deloy. Why? You have the matzah, the loy nafish tamayu. It's very easy to be mevatel the tam of matzah. Anything we're going to eat after matzah is going to be mevatel the tam. Avol acha pesach the nafish tamay. Think about lamb. A lamb it, that lingers in your mouth a long time. A penny fisher is big chassid of lamb. Right? Penny doesn't like that. And and uh, that the, the tam of lamb is lingers in your mouth. So you would think you would be able to eat. So let me boy kamar. Loimi boy matzah that you can eat. Why? Because it's easy to get rid of the tam. But afilu the carbon pesach, which is usually a lamb or a goat, which lingers the taste. You might think you would be able to eat kamashmon. You can't. So again, Rabbi Yochanan and and Shmuel going the signal echad that when it says you should be after means you shouldn't eat after the afikom. You should not eat something because you want that tam to remain in your mouth. It's, a, a drinks do not get rid of it, Mordechai. Only food, another food. It says, it says you can eat something, but drink you could. Why? I'm telling you, it doesn't. I'm, I, no, I'm telling you, I, it's uh, Mishnah Burma. Before you, Mishnah Burma. What? <laughs> By Shalach Manas, a drink is considered like food. Yeah, Shalach Manas, a drink is like food. Yeah, that's the Indian considered, but the Indian mitzios, Achila, you know, it's a physical mitzios. Does drink go ahead and, and take off the tam? We're saying no, it doesn't. The Indian Achila, and as you drink on Yom Kippur, Mosh, it's considered Achila, you have cars, correct? And so the Indian certain things, but the Indian the physical tam of eating something. Okay, so let me boy come out, let me boy I mean, you can't take a lesson on Bible, you could eat. Kamash Mon, you can't. Name a Messiah, lay out, bring you a proof. These are all different types of matzah, guys. The next. Hasufkonim, Badufshonim, Bayeskaritin. This is this is different. They're fried in oil and in, in, in shemen and in, in dvash, all different types of soft types of um, matzah. Odom Malakresoi Behen can fill your stomach with them. Ubilvad Shayochel Kazayas Matzah Bachreina, provided you eat a Kazayas Matzah in the end. And we're going to get back to this in a second. Bachrona in dafka that dafka if you eat matzah afterwards, but he's shown low. But not what if you eat matzah first. So you can't eat these things after the matzah. Why? Because it's going to take away the time of the matzah. So apparently that's a good riot to Shmuel, right? That after the matzah you can't eat something. So it's a me boy come. Let me boy, but he's showing the kachel the oven. Not of course. Let me boy. Of course you can eat matzah the first. Why? Because you're eating the oven, which is the way we began the perik. The whole reason we go ahead and from. Uh, from uh, uh, the reason we wait uh, to eat from that time is to create the oven. So, of course, I might think that eating matzah afterwards, that you're eating a chilagasa, that these things will not fill you to the extent you'll be able to eat matzah. Masucha Mashla Hafner, Masucha learns the dialogue the same way, a uh, different way. I'm Yehuda, I'm Ashmol, Naftirin Acha. Hamatza Afi Koimin, your mafta if the matza afi koimin, mean name a messiah. No, you could eat afterwards. Name a messiah, you could eat afterwards. And now, what was the kasha before is now a, a, a proof. A maftir and acha pesach you koimin, acha pesach deloy. If the pesach you can't, alacha matza maftir and if the matza you could eat. So that's more lomi boy coming. No, so you can't eat either one. Lomi boy, acha matza deloy, why? Because loy nafish time, therefore you can eat. Avlacha pesach emeloy, kamash malon. Mesave now will ask a question. Hasufkonim, Babdushonim, Baskarit, and all these different types of sponge matzahs. Odam Amali Kresa Mehen, Ubavachi, Yochel Kazayas Matzah Beachroina, Dafka Bachroina in Berishoin Aloy. 
It's not like my Zotra. Says me, let me buy Kama. Let me buy every shina the Kachla the oven. You could Alvachwina the Asil Michla Achila Gasa afterwards come out like Mashalan. Now, so therefore, again, you couldn't even have the Afikana. What is the Khil of Afikana? What 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 is Afikana? What is Afikana? So posh it. Here's the way we learn. We, this is the way we always learn our life, right? You go ahead, you make kiddish, you wash your hands, you eat karpas, you say da goda, you get to mitzi matzah, you're gonna make make bich suda. You're gonna take two 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 shleimos together, lecha mishnah. You're gonna make a bracha on them. You're gonna draft the bottom one, and then you're gonna make a bracha on the mitzvah of matzah or the erev toichel matzahs. And between the two, I'll be yoytzer the moitzi with the koyin that we spoke out, and with we'll the lady will be yoytzer the erev toichel matzahs. We spoke that out. The arichas, good. That's the way you always learn. Then you eat your meal, and then you have the afikomen. The afikomen is a zeicha to the carbon pesach. You eat two kazeisim. We'll discuss that soon to this evening, and you, everything is great. Be aware. We're going to see right now. There's a shita that the chiyav of matzah of moitzi matzah is not the first matzah you eat before marar. It's the chiyav of afikomen. Shitas Rashi, Shitas Ramban, which we're going to see inside right now. We're going to see it right now. Again, you can't ask a question. I'm telling you information for the first time. You could ask, but let's see it inside. We're going to see Machloik is that in the rush. We know it like the rush and, and, and the Ramban and men, most of them are Farshim. Be aware, Gedoyle Rishonim, Rashi, heavy hitter. Rashi and Ramban of the opinion that that's the main matzah. And I just want to show you the Rashbam, that I just said the Ramban and the Rashbam. I, I just want to show you inside where it is. Look at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven lines in the bottom. Seven lines in the bottom. Ei maftir acha acha hamatz afi koyimin. You can't be mafter. You can't take. You shouldn't eat anything after matz afi koyimin. Shet sarich lecho matzah begemar suda. Sorry, you have to eat matzah at the end of the suda. Zeche lematzah hanacheles ima pesach. To the again as a remembrance for the matzah. That's eaten with the carbon pesach. Umatzas umroi mechluhu. Vikricha, together with the carbon pesach. Vizuhi matzah habetsua. And this is the matzah that you broke. This is levi. Sha'anu oichlim ba'achroina l'shem chayva. That we eat l'shem chiv of matzah. V'al kachenu on the. Okay, guys, you hear? He says it mafurish. He says at the end of the suda, you're eating. A, ma- a matzah lezecha of the Karim Pesach, and in addition, you're eating the matzah lechiyuva of the erev toichel matzahs. That's where you get your shnei by the way. That's where you get your, why, why you eat two kaseisim. By, by, he, he says it openly. This is Yankel. This is this is why you're waiting for this, right? This is he says it openly. Avram, you see it? Yeah. The, 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 the uh, 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 so let's see. Let's see. Uh, now he's going to ask that right now. So what do you do before? Right. Now his question is not why you eat matzah before, because you always can eat before the suda. Before the suda you're eating. You wash for the suda. You make a moitzi for su- any suda you make a moitzi for, right? It's a suda's yontif. It's a chilas mitzvah. Question is, why do you make the bracha ala chilas matzah on, on that before, right? Uh, even though that matzah is not yechiv of matzah, guys. That's the chiyav of Suda. So why are you making the bracha ala chilas matzah on the first set? Huh? Many a kiddush, huh? They make a matzah like a And but you make you're also making a dish of what, Aaron? Oh, why are you making ala chilas matzah? A matzah pashtetzach you have to make. Oh. Now why are you making a bracha kida um rav kista leel gabe mora? Guys, remember rav kista by mora? I'll remind you. You use your mora for karpas. What did rav kista say? What bracha you make on mora? And then, Alachilas Mora on the first set also. Why? Because how can you fill your stomach with that? And then you don't make a bracha at all on the other one at the end. That's when we look at my Mora. We brought it down to Shulchan Aruch, right? You guys, remember? That was where we... Dak, right? Dak, where are you? Show yourself. This is what you're getting your shver on, right? So it's the same Sfara by Matzah, guys. What are you doing? It's the same svaro and matzah. What are you doing? You're eating matzah. How can I fill my stomach with matzah and then make a bracha alachilas matzah later on? The same way I can't make a bracha alachilas mora later on. So I'm making the bracha since I'm going to fill myself up with matzah. But I'm not the chiv of, just like the chiv of mora is later on, the chiv of, of 
the Erev Toichel Matzis, the Araisa, is later on. That's the sheet of Rashi and the Rashbam. I just mean Rashbam because he's more Myra. Why not? We eat matzah with an appetite, right? Number one. Number two is it's a No, you, no you, it doesn't. Oh, well, you're, you're eating because, but you're eating outside. But but before, before, before. Anyway, Rav Kistel, Gabi Mora, the Laachesh, Shemil Kresim, Mimeno, Hey Chosim, Mubarak Love, Hilkach, Mubarak Hatshirayu Bereshi. They both first. After that matzah, you don't leave the suda by eating anything else. You shouldn't forget. This is speaking bizman azeh. The lekka pesach behado. The e bizman the ikka pesach. A behead yit nan. Aim after an acha pesach afi koimen. The acha acha pesach umatza and a chelasimo. In other words, this din that we just said in after an acha matza is only speaking bizman azeh. Sheet, this is the sheet of the of the this is the sheet of, of, of Rashi, the sheet is of the Rashbam. And it's for us, it's a huge Kiddush. For us, it's a huge Kiddush. Questions the rush. Here's the lushan of the rush, right? First of all, if it's a key of matzah, right? And you're eating the kricha, so you should have mara there. You should also have charisis there. <laughs> you should at the end, you should have it at the end, right? Well, if you, if you say how you near a shetzar lechali mamora b'charoisis kimachu zeicha matzah nachelas and a pesach, since you're telling me this is a zeicha and matzah and it's chalas a pesach, you should have the same guidelines as pesach. The kricha v'alei mo yeroich levarach al chilas matzah el shikharim em kein zeich lasus kamoi bezeb amigdash and zeich lamigdash hilkach nearly the oisem matzah ain't l'shem chayva. That matzah that we for a chiyav guy a karm pesach is not l'shem chayva. El oichlon is a zechel pesach. If the whole purpose is it's, it's a remembrance for the karm pesach, shohay nechal ala soiva that you would eat when you're satiated be achreina. Well, if you zechel pesach, yeshlitein lo din a pesach shlo lechel acharecha. And since it's like just like we don't eat anything after the karm pesach, we don't eat anything after the avi karm. That's the way we, we pass it. I just want to make you aware there is this uh, Rashi and, 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 and Rajbam. This is tremendous, tremendous Chuluki Deus. Tremendous Chuluki Deus across the board. Maish. I know this is similar to that Kamara we had by Mara, but how does Rashi explain that you have a chiv the rice to eat matzah and you ate matzah, so you're yotz to the mitzvah already? How is it delayed? You ate that matzah because you can't eat bread. I think there's, there's a din like there's matzah b'makam suda. And there's matzah l'shem matzah. So when you go ahead and you're baitseya, when you're baitseya, you're eating that like mitoch, you're kaveya sud on bread, right? Betsiya sapas, right? Allah has betsiya sapas. So therefore, even though it happens to be matzah, you need l'shem matzah. But the matzah chiv, that is only if. So then mitzvahs need kavana we're coming out with? Well, you would need, you would need kavana. You would need kavana l'shem. That's what you have to do, l'shem pesa. You have to do it. Of course, you have to, that we said. You, uh, we said that you have to do shame, even if you're going to take. Again, it's not for a kid to eat. So he's asking, well, you need kavana for the mitzvah pashas. You need kavana l'shem mitzvah. So that yeah. was Rish Lakish's whole thing, and we asked it out, but it's the same thing here. Uh, yeah, no? yeah, Rish Lakish was was more because it was it was there was a reason that we ate the more we dipped was the second dipping over here. You don't have that svara. You don't have that svara of the second dipping. Why do we make ourselves matzah? What? Why do we make well, well, no, we do it because we hold like the rush. So it's not a problem. That's, you know. According to Rosh Bam is because the same thing with Mara. You can't possibly not make a bracha on something that you're doing physically. Like Mike said, you're, you're filling your stomach with the stuff and you're not going to make a bracha on it. I mean, how can you not do that? It's like the car product. Like the Mara. Exactly. It's exactly like that. Not, not like that. Exactly like that. So you make the, 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 the Again, this we don't pass them like this. Again, okay, it's partial like this. You're making a moitzi sas. And now, how could you not make a bracha al chilas matzah when you're going to fill your stomach with matzah? By mara, by mara. Again, forget here. Mar, is mar, by by mara, by mara, by mara, you had the same thing. You, how is it physically possible to go ahead and eat mara and then make a bracha later on? After you have more in your stomach, how can you physically go ahead and not make a bracha on matzah when you have it in your stomach? It's the same svara. It's the same svara. Uh, are you talking to the person who's in Chayyim? And that's why he's hiding because he, he knows he's going to face the wrath of Stern. He's not the candidate. He's not the candidate here. Oh, yeah, where, where are you going for Pesach? <laughs> I did. Where are you going? <laughs>
Okay. Yeah, that's what you meant. Yeah, okay. Uh, stop, stop talking to the Yitzhah. Yeah, it's a trash. Uh, because we, that's what we hold. We, 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 we pass in that you should. We don't want to eat matzah. We, You, you, you're you supposed to, if you eat everything in the end, then you'll be in a full stomach. If you get all you start eating matzah, then it will not be a hidden mitzvah. That's the, how we started the parrot, right? Great. Amarava, matzah bismana zed Huh? Well, again, this, this two, this, this we'll see. We'll, we'll see the whole thing. I'll be coming in a second. I'm a rabbi. Matzah bismana zed the raisa who married the rabbana. Matzah in this time, day and age, is the raisa married the rabbana. Maishna mara, what's, what's the reason married the rabbana, guys? The chsivit says, al matzah is umroim yokluhu, that you should eat, right? When, when do you eat it? When do you, what are you eating? You eat in Karim Pesach. This man, they come Pesach. In the time there's a Pesach, yesh mara, then there's a dinner mara. This man does like a Pesach, and this man does not Pesach. Like a Mora, then this man there's no Mora. Matzah nami hakaksev al matzah sumer miyafluha. Matzah, okay. So in other words, lecheri guys, if you can use the pasuk of matzah sumer miyafluha, just like Mora is the rabbanan, matzah should also be the rabbanan. So that Mora answers matzah mahad the beikra. The Torah put back inside. The Torah went back and said that you know what <laughs> that it is it's uh, the matzah is is the chi of the raisa because the pasuk says. The of So there's two reasons to eat matzah, guys. There's matzah that accompanies the Pesach, and then there's a separate chiyav of the of toichel matzah. Good. So the chiyav of of of, of a carbon Pesach would be the rabbanon by matzah as well. Since we have another pasuk, the of toichel matzah, it makes the chiyav the raisa. Makes the because this is independent of the carbon. The erev toichel matzah. This is independent. Had an issue putting the rabbanon before the raisa, putting the rabbanon before the rabbanon. No, that's seems to be an issue. Rav Achba Yaakov Oma Echad Zeh Vechad Zeh. Besides, we do we do the midrasha first. We do matzah first. We do we, you do matzah before matzah. No, oh, you don't. Know. The no, no one's yotzer with karpas. We said you're not yotzer with karpas. We said that if you, you you use them even if you use the matzah for karpas, you're not yotzer. You hear matzah. If you hear matzah is afterwards. You made the bracha, but you weren't yotzer. You hear that the matzah is like kasha, right? Says the Gemara. Rav Achba Yaakov Oma Echad Zeh Vechad Zeh. Say matzah and say mara the rabbanon. They both what? They both the rabbanon. Ella haksev verev tochel matzos. What does Rav Acha by Yaakov do with the pasuk? Tell us. It says verev tochel matzos. What does he do with that pasuk? Right? The pasuk's mashma. It's the raisa. Says Mora. He mi boi lei letame ushayi b'derech chayka. Now we know by now that if a person was tummy b'derech chayka, he would go to Pesach sheni. So you might think the following: If he's tame and he's not even current Pesach, maybe he shouldn't eat matzah either. If he's tummy and he's very chayka and he's part from the current Pesach, maybe he shouldn't eat matzah either. The era of Teichel matzah, he still eats matzah. He still eats matzah. That's what Rav Acha uses it for. Even though the Chiyav is the Rabbanon, he eats matzah, even though he's part from the current Pesach. The Sakhle, I mean, I would have thought. What? The, the Rabbanon. He just said it's the Rabbanon, matzah is manaseh. The Sakhle, I mean, on. Okay, when, again, when it's. It, when you have the carbon Pesach, then it's the Raisa. When you don't have the carbon Pesach, it's the Rabbana. Mm -hmm. Again, again, this is the Raisa, because again, who would the, if you're a Tomei and Derek a Chayka, it has to be speaking Bismandi as a carbon Pesach. Right. There, the Chiev will be the Raisa. Mm -hmm. yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. The Erev Toichel Matzos. Good. Now, keeping the Pesach, I might think since he's not even the current Pesach, because he has the Petura of Wad of being Tomei and Mederech Chayka, Kamash Malon, the Wad, he's Chayv and Matzah and Mora, the Raisa. Kamash Malon. The Rava, now Rava who says, Berev Toichel Matzah, how does he know that if you're Tomei or Bederech Chayka, how does he know you're Chayv that to eat, even though you're not being a Pesach? Rava, Amalach, Tomei, you're Shayv, Bederech Chayka, like Tzarech Ka. If he's Tomei, you're Derech Chayka, you do not need what united a pasik. Flegora may oral. It's not worse than an oral ben necha. Now it's an oral ben necha cannot eat from the current pesach. <laughs> the tanya 
Kol oral loyachal boy. Anyone who's uncircumcised cannot eat it. Cannot eat the carbon pesach. What's the limud? Boy ain't oichel. It he cannot eat. I will oichel be matzul marer. But he eats matzul marer. Therefore, he does not eat the pasuk of the erev toichlu matzos. He can infer it from the miut that said by carbon pesach of the oral and the zacher. The oral and the zacher are part of from carbon pesach. Boy, but it's it, in other words, they're initially they're all in the ballpark of everything. Now we just take them out of the ballpark of Karim Pesach, but they remain the Chiyav of Matzah in Mara, therefore you're not necessarily the Pesach of the Erev Toichel of Matzah. Ele must be to teach me that I feel Shaloi Bizman Karim Pesach, like now, in the year 2021, we still have a Chiyav, the Arisa, to eat Matzah. Guys, the unbelievable thing, the only Chiyav that you have that's the Arisa, the Achila, is Pesach, is Matzah. There is nothing else, nothing else my my, my she asked me he goes what about eating erev yom kippur i said eating erev yom kippur is a chiv on the gavra it's a chiv for you to eat there's no chiv in the in what you're eating matzah is the only one is a chiv the rice to eat yes Rebbe, did they did they eat the matzah for the 38 years 39 years in the desert that they weren't doing the carbon pesach pashas they did pashas they, they did mon. yeah they pashas they did but i don't know again with the mon i wonder if the mon fell during pesach right <laughs> <laughs> had towel on it. I know it came down. It was towel. Yeah, it was all Shilas. So the Hasidim didn't eat it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay. Anyway, the Edoch Rav Acher Why? Why did it? Why did it do with the Leman? Guys, Rav Acher Bar Yaakov says the following. He says the Erev Toichel Matzas teaches me that what. That a uh, uh, that um, a tome can has can eat matzah, and he needs a pasuk to tell me that an oral and a uh, ben nechar person who makes himself a, a ben nechar to a kodesh baruch also eats matzah, and you need idak siv b'hai siv b'hai. But tzrich you need to tell me both. He doesn't say the tzrich is over here. The rashbam goes through the tzrich is. The rashbam seems to say that there's two tzadim either way. We see a quick Rashbam. Let's look a quick Rashbam. Ksibai, Ksibai, but Sricha. That's six lines down. The Tomei Yushayi Bader Chachayka, the Yolof Meyar, the Kinlin at Tomei, their Chachayk Meyar and Benecha. Why? The Isle Tashlum and the Pesach Sheni. The the Tomei and their Chachayka, they have a Tashlum in Pesach Sheni. An Oral does not. An Oral and a Benecha does not have a Tashlum in. So you can't learn one from the other. Wait till the second Pesach, and then you can go ahead and do everything right on, on your Daladir. It makes sense that she eat because they're not going to have a chance for Shani. That's one way to learn it. Because Rahman, if you're a have a I would only use it for Baral Benecha. You shouldn't bless the Tashlumen. I will tell me if they're a Chaykh, this is Tashlumen, I would say that what? They make it up Tashlumen. Kamashmulan, that what? No, they go to Pesach. Pesach Rishon also. So therefore, there's a, there's a Tzrich so. so therefore, that's where Yaakov, Yaakov says you need both Pesukim. Back inside. Tani Kabbalah say the Rava. We have a Bryce that's a riot to Rava that the Erev Tochel Matzis is a Din de Araisa. The Erev Tochel Matzis spell is a Din de Araisa. The Sheishes Yom and Tochel Matzis, six days you should eat Matzah. Uvo Yom HaShmini, and on the se- Shvi, at Seres La Shem Elokecha, and Shvi now is at Seres. So we took she, we took six days out of the rule of seven. If there's seven, six of the chal seven. Mashvi rishus, just like shvi, it's a rishus. Just sa'av sheish shomim is rishus. Now, when it says that we have a shvi at seres, it doesn't say toichel matzos. So obviously that there's no mitzvah to eat on the seventh day. That's why all the chasidim they eat gebrux. That's why the chasidim eat, wow. eat on the last day. Why? Because there's no chi of the matzos. So the chi of the matzos is rishus. They find the heter. But they eat on the eighth day. Eighth yeah, day you're right. right. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah, okay. The Chayra, they. I just saw the old Brock. Actually, you know, Eric just saw you find because it's fired them. You find kidneys. You go to the supermarket. I was there for Pesach. You go to the supermarket. They, they, they earmark that it's not, not for Ashkenazim. Yogurt. They, 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 what? We started here more and more. Like, more and more. How would you know? How would you know if you go to Jamaica? 
the Torah makes it a chiv to eat matzah on the first night. You guys have you have grace of kavod. This is mamish is a mitzvah that comes once a year, and you never know who knows what's going to be next year, right? What? So they have they eat the spell, they eat oats, they they have feltnish, they they eat all kinds of stuff that's expensive and it tastes like nishkut. Of course you have to. It's a mitzvah. What is what is again? These are mitzvahs. Seiras haMelech. What does it have to do with like or dislike? Right. You wipe cups and it's not good. Don't you have to leave anyway and say it's good? Notice somebody. Right. When it comes to food, somebody pipes okay. up very quickly. <laughs> okay. Gotta be careful. You find that it's not all that the kidney is not also. Steve, you enjoying the clear the clear picture? I was gonna say you it, you weren't using it the last couple of days. I was, I absolutely was. I have been using it since you bought it for me. It's spectacular. I guess it's a function of the light. It's spectacular. Okay. Anyway, says the Mishnah. Yashnei mikzasayin. If part of the people sleep. Then yochlu, then they could eat. It's not considered like the oh, out of the ballpark. Now there's a kulon. If they all sleep, everyone falls asleep. Lo yochlu. Now this is speaking about the carbon pesach. Rashbam says who are did matzah. It would also apply to matzah. That this din of, of in other words, if, if everyone falls asleep, that's it. You can't eat anymore. The yosef oim it depends. It's going back on the on the mitzas. Nisnamnu, if they just slumber, yochlu, they can eat near the mu. But if they're in a atifa shlof, lo yochlu. Ha pesach achatzois yochlu. Stop. Ha pesach achatzois mitam esa yadayim. Pesach if the chatzois is mitam yadayim. If the chatzois is considered nicer. If the chatzois is considered nicer, ha pigel the carbon that you had the rog machshava b'shas shkita. Or Kabbalah, Eloch, and Zrika of Chutzlis Machim and Chutzlis Man is Pigel, Neuser, leftover, Metamas Yedayim, Midrabana de Metama the Yedayim. Now, this Mishnah clearly states that what? That the Efta Chatzais. Every carbon, the, every carbon, the, you get a day of the Shrita and the night, the following night. A carbon Asham, carbon Chatas, any Kachikadashim, you would get the day and the night, and you'd have to burn it by morning. Carbon toida, also day and a night. Shlomim, you get two days and a night. Carbon right? Pesach is uniquely different. We say only ad chatzais. Because we have machloikis, we're going to see right now, a huge machloikis, which is, it's a pillar that we waited this long to get to the machloikis between Rebbe Loza ben Azariah and Rebbe Akiva. Rebbe Loza ben Azariah learns out that the Carbon Pesach is only until chatzais. You hear, they got a very small window. And this is the great effect of why the Afi Koyman, if it's Zechel, the Karim Pesach, is only at Chatzais. Conversely, conversely, according to Rabbi Kiva, you would get the whole night. Okay, and we're going to see that right now. So from our Mishnah, the Mishnah clearly is going according to Rebbe Loza ben Azariah, because it says at Chatzais, it becomes nicer already. So you see, you're out of the ballpark at what? At midnight, at, at Chatzais, not midnight, at Chatzais. You're out of the ballpark then, not in the morning. You're, you're out of the ballpark already then. Says the, says the Gemara. Rabbi Yossi, I mean, Rabbi Yossi says, Nisnamnu, if you just slumber, yochlu, near the move in a deeper sleep, lo yochlu. This is about mitzas. Then you can't eat anymore. The Karim Pesach. Hechi domi nisnam name. What does it mean that you're, you're slumbering? That you're, summer vashi, nim v'le nim, you're up but not up, tir v'le tir, you're, you're sleeping, sleeping, up, up. If you're going to Karile, you call him, you say, Harry, and he answers, lo yodel adur yisvara, but you ask him something that, that, that requires thought, he can't answer you. However, v'chi mitkaru le mitkar. If you remind him, he'll remember. That's the, that's, that's what we call Nisnam name. 
Abaya Rabbi Yosef Kamei the Rabba. Abaya was Yosef Kamei the Rabba. He was Lachira. Rabba was Abaya was sitting in front of Rabba, and Chazi the Konamnei. He saw he was sleeping. Amalei Meim Konoyim Mar. Are you sleeping and meaning and therefore you can't eat anymore? Amalei Minumi Konamnei. Sleeping. He says, no, I was only slumbering and therefore I would be able to eat. Now, Abaya and Rabba lived well after the Karvin Pesach. They lived well after the Churban Bias. Again, the Bias was destroyed by Bashas Yochel and Zakai. They blessed the Tanai Rabbi Kiva. It was destroyed then. This is speaking of Amorayim. No, no Amoira ever saw the Beis Hamikdash. So, the Rashbam wants to bring a riot from over here that this din of slumbering and sl- of waking and being asleep and not asleep, whether you can eat, is going on matzah. Or else, why is this machloik between Rabbah and 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 and, 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 and It's a moot point, right? Right? Toysavis, however, says that it can't be going on matzah because this is a din that's unique to Pesach. So in fact, Toysavis on itself, so why, why are they shepherding? Why does Abayah shepherding Rabbah? So he says, it's not speaking about Pesach at all. It's speaking about a tainus. It's speaking about a tainus. If you go to sleep at night and you fall asleep, even though the t- and then you wake up, you can't eat. You have to have it. You can't have hesach adas. You know, if you go to sleep at night, you have to have a mind that what you could eat, right? So what happens if you fall asleep? That's what the discussion is over here. Mm-hmm. It's a tainus discussion. Nothing to do with pesach whatsoever. And there, because Tosis holds what? It's only going on the current pesach. So he had to found the nafkamin and halacha between the two. So Tosis says it's going on, on tainus. And Rashi says, no, it's good. Rashban goes Lashitasai that it's speaking about matzah. And matzah is manaseh, therefore you'll be able to eat not eat. Okay, that's the Chuluk Degas Halim Shan, this Gemara. Now, Alma says, Pesach ach chatzois, metam es yedayim. The Pesach after chatzois will metam yedayim because it's considered nicer. Alma me chatzois, heavily, heavily nicer. We see at chatzois, it's considered nicer. Man Tana, who's the Tana who says that at chatzois, it's considered nicer? So Amr Rav Yosef, Rav Laz Ben Azariah, he is Rav Laz Ben Azariah. The Tanya, it says, the Ochel es ha-bosa b'layla hazeh, you should eat the bosa this night. Rav Laz Ben Azariah says, nema kan b'layla hazeh, it says, by the Korban Pesach b'layla hazeh. V'nema l'halon, it says, by Makas b'choyris. V'avarti b'eretz Mitzrayim b'layla hazeh. And I, I will pass through Mitzrayim b'layla hazeh. Ma l'halon, by HaKadosh Baruch Hu, when they, when they die, at Chatzoyz. Afkan at Chatzais. So to over here until Chatzais. That's what Lozim and Azariah. Amal Rebbe Kiva, Loi Nemar. Does it make a difference if you, if you just, okay, may I have to fall asleep or not if you don't have Chatzais? What, 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 what do you mean? They were, they were having a debate before whether or not if you just dozed off or whether or not. No, that, that, that's a separate issue. That, that, that's one issue. The dozing off, not dozing off. We're not speaking about that. Now we're speaking about what's this man of Achilles called Pesach? Okay. That's what, yeah, what's this man of Achilles called Pesach? So when the Mishnah said that if the Chatzois, it's already nicer, so obviously it must be the Zman is up until Chatzois. That's the sheet of Rebbe Lazar Benazariah. Because Rebbe Yerikiv is going to learn now, Aaron, you can go even after Chatzois. All right, now, Amalur it says, at Kipazain in a haste, at Shas Kipazain, right? And meaning, which is the morning, the whole night. And came at Tamalim and Belayla, Yochel Yenechal Kikotchen Bayoim. I might think it should be eaten like, like eating kosher in the, the day. Tamalayim belayla. Belayla hu nechal vayna nechal bayoyim. You can only eat the korban pesach by night. You can't eat it during the day. Rebbe Kiva, hai hazeh my oven. Like, what does Rebbe Kiva do with, with the limit of Rebbe Allah Zabin Azai of hazeh? He boiled the mute layla acher, a second night. So in other words, I would think you can eat it one night. You can't eat it, but eat it the next night. Salkadai chamina hoil pesach kosher kalim. Ushlam kosher kalim. I might think they're both kosher kalim. Just like Shlom, you get two days and a night. So put the nights in place for the day, and therefore you should be able to eat it in two nights. Therefore it says, what? And, and, and one night, and that's it. But, but, but you could eat it that night and the whole, uh, whole, whole night. It says, you can't leave over till the morning. So I know I can't go ahead and have another night. It says you can leave over the current basic till the morning. So what kind of have a mina? If I leave it over Monday night, I can leave, I have it Tuesday night. It says you can't leave it over till Monday morning. So okay, you can have a have a mina. Rabbi Kiva Mulach, Eloi Kasser Rahman Hazer, have a mina by Baike. Baike means Baike Shani. I mean, it means the second, say, we mean Chalamite. Rabbi Lazlam, Rabbi Lazlam, Kalecha the Kasser Baike, Baike Rishan. When it says one Baike, it means Baike Rishan. 
If you eat matzah after then Rav Lezman Azariah is manazeh, you're not yet yechiyev. This would be apparently a right for Ashpam, right? It's going to be a matzah, yeah? She took, keep in this, it's the Pesach, the Pesach, the Amimah, the Tema, the Afgei Kroam, the Hekesha, and the Kamash Malon, the Kihadri Kroam, the Milsa Kamaisa Hadri. When you put it back in, you put it back in, what? The Inyan, the Inyan that what? You also can only eat until in, until until chatzais, you can only eat until chatzais. Now this thing about carbon pesach chatzais, not chatzais. This is a uh, lepashtus with pasuk like Rabbi like Rabbi uh, Lazar ben Azayin, the mish chabin tofay and Zayin. La'achid gemar kol asuda. After you finish the asuda, oichel mimatzah shmura tachas hamapa. You take the masha shmura that's underneath the mapa. Hastest one, the one you know that the kid made in school, right there. It's in the mapa. Kizayis kol echad zeichel zeichel pesach. As the Zechel Pesach, Hanechal al Sabea, that's even while you're satiated. The Yochlenu has Seba, you should eat it with a Seba. Lo Yivarech, love, you don't make a bracha on it. Of a Motzi, the Hizor, Lo Ochla, you should be very careful to eat it. Koydem Chasoy, Koydem Chasoyis, that's the Machabe. It says the Ramah, the Yaktam Atzmei Shigam al Halu, Koryat Koydem Chasoyis. You should even say Halu before Chasoyis. Says the Mishnah Bura, Kezayis, Ula Chachila, Toiv, Sheikach, Chais, this is where you pass in, Shnei Zesim. You should take two zeisim. Echa zecha le Pesach, the echa zecha le Matzah Hanacheles Imoi. Guys, no, so here you hear. We know we have a carbon Pesach, right? And we know with the carbon Pesach was accompanied with Matzah Zamara, right? So when you're eating the Afikoyimim, there's two two kivunim you should have in mind. One, I don't have a carbon Pesach. This should be in place of the carbon Pesach. Well, we actually said, but it's not, it's not a Pesach. So Rasha said, since the only achila we have is manazed, that's the raisa, it's the closest thing. Only again, I keep on stressing. Think about it. All the things we eat and everything, and we'll see man and milsahi and all fressing we do. Jews, what we do is eat and eat and eat and eat and eat and eat. And eat. And eat. You ever look at garbage? You go to guys' garbage, right? We have a little beer full of beer bottles right outside. They're, they're no garbage. That's what I don't know what they do. They have no, they have no garbage. You go, you can score a Jewish. Just go down the block. You know, you see the Kratzmich lights, you see the guy, you want a Jewish neighborhood, go to their garbage, you know exactly the Jewish neighborhood. You see all the garbage out there. We eat, we eat, we eat. The only eating that we have is that a mitzvah, chefzah shal mitzvah is matzah. Says Rabbi Asha, therefore, the, the, we make it zechel and migdah, zechel and pesach. It's the closest thing. Now, in addition, you're eating a piece of matzah in conjunction with that carbon pesach, right? U matzah That's the second zayas. And that's why I told you the shear is 30. And each night, it doesn't make a difference whether it's a, 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 a Suda Swishan or Suda Shani, you should eat 30, 30 grams. 30 grams, both of, 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 of matzah. Why don't we have mower again by the Afikomen? What? That, we're having two kazais of a matzah, one for the carbon Pesach, one for the matzah. Why don't we have another kazais of mower also? Yes, it, it's, it's a good question. It's a good question. I don't know the answer to the question. Right. Yeah. Lays, if, if matzah is so connected to the Afrikaman, why again? So why isn't that the uh, the raisa? Yeah, you you see here beforehand. Add the rabba. The Rashbam says it is the raisa. The Rashbam says it's the raisa. But again, we ate achiev and we say, we're only doing this as zeich of the pesach. And now apparently, apparently we're paskening like Rebbe Loza Ben Azari, you guys, right? Because we're eating before chatzos. And we're eating zeichel because he held the current Pesach, and where the zeichel is, uh, the zeichel is, is is the chatzos. So uh, apparently we're eating like pas, which is a chiddush, because usually machloikis Rabbi Akiva the chaver of halach Rabbi Akiva. Uh, so the answer is we have a stam mishnah like Rabbi Rabbi. In other words, in the klali psak fellas, right? What overcomes one of the klali psaks? We pass in like an anonymous mishnah. We have an anonymous mishnah that says it's nicer. It's nice only because we fast and like Rebbe and Azaria. So therefore, that would seem to override. Now, there are other Rishonim who say, the other Rishonim who say that, that, uh, that you could go ahead and, and, and extend it beyond. Now, I, I, I listened to Suli Bornstein today. He said an unbelievable Chiddush from the Avnei Nezer. He said an unbelievable Chiddush. And listen to this Chiddush, he said. There's a, in Arachayim and Shinpei Aleph, the, the Avnei Nezer. It's the Shachachav, the Avrami Shachachav. In front of Gedoli, 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 Chasidish Rebbe's, but Goyin Sheb Goyinim. They say they say on him. His father showed him the Aleph face once. Once 
Once, that was it. You started from once. That was it. So he said, he said like this. He doesn't understand. He says, you're eating this zeichel, you're eating this what? You need the, the tam. You can't eat after chatzois. If the current pace is bought the chatzois, right? You're going ahead and eating it. You want the tam, right? So what's pshat chatzois? Chatzois is, you don't know exactly what chatzois is. So you eat it, and, and you eat it, and you should have zin. If this is, 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 is the current Pesach, at this period of time, then it should be the same current Pesach, right? And therefore, I'm getting some achiev over here, right now. I'm getting some achiev, and, and then you can eat later on, and keep on eating, but that's tonight. And if it's not the current Pesach, then the other one's the current Pesach. So he seems to say that the, the Biskarov seem to have liked this at Eitzah, but Rav Moshe sp- spoke against it. So then we do what we do, guys. When you eat the, the main thing, you're eating two zeisim, two zeisim. Remember, one is the zeichel the pesach, the other one zeichel the 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 matzah that accompany the pesach. We have a we have a obvious question about what about murder. I said again, I don't know why we don't. I'll, I'll I'll get you an answer for it. It's a good question, but that seems to be the agdala. Okay, tomorrow night, Bez Hashem, the the seum will be in the where we moved it to a restaurant, the T Fusion restaurant. 3223 Quentin Road. Uh, 7.30, we'll say the daf. 8 o'clock, so, so around then should be the CM. Uh, everyone's invited to come. I figured that we'll get about 20 people all together. It should be okay. We, it's a, spending four, four months together doing a very good shmak in the sector. Why would you get uh, What's the sales price? What? Why would you get that tonight?